Hello everyone and welcome to a new modern video. I'm playing uh, one more deck that came from the RCQ in Pisa that top aided. I was able to beat this deck in the top eight in the um, in the Swiss, but you know they managed to win every other match, which is uh, very impressive because it plays a lot of cards that you wouldn't assume uh, to be uh, very good in modern, like Stygia Supplier, What of the Reliquary Bloodgast. The engine is definitely powerful. Nethergoyf is incredible in this deck. It's so big. Plus, you self mill yourself and you reanimate. This card was constantly very large. You also have Saga, which is both enchantment and land for, for type. Saga has a few targets, and you have more, more targets in the side. Um, yeah, so it's playing one of my favorite cards in Legacy, White of the Red Quarry. Although in Legacy, your lands are much better. You have Gaia's Cradle, you have Talon's Gates of Madara. But here you still have Bajuka Bong and uh, Spy Master's Vault, and most importantly, Urza Saga. Uh, Flare of Malice very plays very well with Bloodgust. Hopefully, I can see all the tricks this deck is able to make. And uh, yeah, let's go Modern League. We have, of course, Push and Thoughtseize as an interaction. We also play one copy of Village Rights, which plays well with Blood Gas. Of course, we have Orc. 21 lands are a big number. Spy Master's Vault is definitely a land that. Um, Doesn't see that much play, but when it works, it's very strong. Okay, let's start on the play with what do we got? What do we got? Uh, our hand is functional. Yeah, it's functional. Keep it. Gigant as my opponent. Assume they play Boris. I have push. I think I want to go turn one Nethergoyf, because on turn two I can go Thoughts to Supplier and attack for a lot with Nethergoyf. Put him off to five. Let's go. Oh, the swamp. I can always take a land. I can always take an overgrown tomb with this land. But if I draw overgrown tomb, then I don't need it. Let's see what they're on. Hello, Andy. Welcome. Stopping Rumbold. Okay. Bubble. Okay, you already drew your card. Ragavan, Malevolent Rumble. You can take your Ragavan. Man, it's so nice to see the opponent on Ragavan. How do you still play Ragavan? What happened? Did you just buy too many of them? Oh, I guess I missed sequence here. Should have gone uh, Supplier first in case of Gigantha. Sorry, in case of Bloodgust. My, my bad. Ragavan is like, I don't even need to kill it, it just does nothing. I don't care. I'll play Nethergoyf. But I also play Awar Might. So this thing can kill Saga and he dies through a random and six ping. But I guess it's an artifact for a graveyard anyway when he dies uh, for a Nethergoyf flashback. So it's fine.
One card in and it's booted foot tills, I think. Oh, it's stomping ground. You have a stomping ground in end. Draw. There it is. Third land. I can now bring back uh, Netagoyf. Oh, actually, I can't. I didn't realize I only have three creatures. No, sorry. Three creature, two creatures cards. What does it mean? Anyway, I can exile land, thoughtsies, or spear. It'll be a one, two. But that's, I guess then I can sacrifice it where my for mox amber and then it grows again. Yeah, I think it's a good play. Yeah, the, the, the Stitch Supplier definitely helps fueling the Nagagoyf. I could have returned Giganta last turn. So I'm interested in that. What is a pacifist? Uh, what do I do? Well, I'm gonna attack with uh, all of my creatures now. I guess I should work the, the Ragavan. Even though it's a meaningless card. I can, like, block a creature I have. Anoli Heat. You try to deal this 2 damage? No, how much? Not 6 damage. E va bene. Allora è morto. Uh, so I could suck the Aeor Might to kill the Mox Amber and deal one more damage with the Nether Goyf, but I don't think it's very much worth it. Yeah, th this deck definitely uses Nether Goyf well. Like, that's the thing with this card. I don't think you can just put it in every deck. You have to put it in a deck that can exploit uh, its flashback. All right. Playing against Gruul, uh, Gruul cards. Gruul cards. I'm assuming they have DRC, so I want Endurance. And uh, Nihil Spellbomb. I think I might. They might play Underworld Breach, actually, in that deck. Taking out um, some Grist. Not sure though. Maybe they have Tarmogoyf in their deck. So Grist should be good. Alright, it's done. I did it, Ranella. Was it a good video? I don't have green mana, but it's in my deck. So I'll keep it. If it's not in my hand, it means that it's in my deck. Uh, um, hmm. So I don't want to go land Nergoyf because that dies to Vren and Six, which is in the range of my opponent deck. So I'll just play Supplier first. The big Tarmogoyf now. No, Affinity was not good. It's like one of those decks that you can play modern, but you know, it's definitely going to be unlikely that you win a tournament with it. If you have a budget deck that is good, it's probably Prowess. No, I guess, I guess Storm. Storm is the best uh, budget deck. Alright, so I think I'm going to Flare. I know Ren isn't great and everything, but I think this is just too free.
My Goyf is now a 4-5. Ooh, but my White is a 7. That's a 6-6. Six, six. That's big. 2 minus 6-6 six, six goes much better than Tarmogoyf. Almost Merc died. Yeah, one minus four five and two minus six six. Oh, thanks to Stitch's supplier, by the way. When it goes Mox Amber go. Well, I'm not that. I'll bazooka bong you. Attack and pass. End of turn, I can go Orc and Saka Token, Garza Saga, and the value will be just too much to handle. Card is good. Watch with the Red Quarry. Bolt? Why didn't you bolt in your turn, opponent? Die. It is now a 7-7. Seven, seven. Sometimes you just wish instant were not instant, but were sorcery, so you could play them in your turn. At the same time, when you have like, when you survey land a bad card in the graveyard, sorry, a good card in the graveyard, and you're like, how did I just, like, why did it give me the choice? Why don't I suck the token in response? Uh, because when I was dealing 6 damage to my creatures, which thanks to my play became a 7-7. Seven, seven. Hello, how much damage do I have? And I give you the answer, if you don't understand this, I think it's too hard, I guess. Alright, um, is there a way to kill? No, right? So, auto, no, I can only deal 10 damage maximum. Right? I can only deal 10 damage maximum. Oh, no. Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't have lethal, unfortunately. E va bene, let's start these. Is it possible to have private private training with me? No, I don't enjoy coaching. I don't. I prefer to stream. You can ask me anything though. Almost. What's the best cuisine in the world after the Portuguese one? What Portuguese cuisine famous for? I remember the um, past the nut, which obviously I pronounce it like shit, but I hope you understand. I remember the um, bacalao. Pastel de nata, ecco. Alright, let's go. Stitcher Supplier, Milling Nightagoyf. What did I have for lunch? Uh, where I live, it's 11.18am. My lunch is on the horizon. I don't know what it is, though. She used to side dice. Yes, you did not draw very well. But also, please, 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 don't play Ragavan in your modern deck. 
If you play Ragavan in your modern deck, I automatically assume you don't watch my stream. And that's fine, not everybody has to. But if you're here, please. Let's just play good cards. Oh wow, they took Shadow Spear. That helps me casting Nether Glyph now. Uh, okay. Last a push. One hundred. One hundred cards. What guy do I use for Boros? Um, a Bamzing on Twitter has um, a guide. You have to message him and pay some tickets. He gives you the guide. Tap. Draw. Let's play another Goyf from the graveyard. Exiling creature. Instant artifact. Oh, I can't. That's illegal. Okay, well. And yet. Should play Bejuga Bog, I guess. Ooh, I can buzz his <laughs> key. That's four different, right? Instant is not so good. Yeah, and yet. I don't have it. Go. Illegal in paper. No, not even in paper. Come on. Although I was surprised that two different opponents at the RCQ doubted that I exiled five cards with, with Flage and double checked. So, I guess it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> I was just, I was surprised. I was surprised. <laughs> so, a pride. <sighs> Which is. Take two. And uh, connive. Boseju. I think Bajuka Bog is good because of Flage. Oh, perfect. Bloodgust. Exactly when I wanted to draw it. Okay, let's flashback Nether Goyf. Instant land artifact creature. It's very tiny, but it'll grow. The, the Spellmaster Vault is very good. Very underplayed, I think. When this card got printed, I was playing Mono Black. I was very high on this. It does a lot. That's too much. Two also a pride is one too many. You know, one thing I thought it was good, but actually I've never had time to prep to play more, was Mockingbird. Like Mockingbird Ocelot Pride was actually a very powerful combo. I flashback small goyf instead of playing large goyf from hand. Uh, that's a good question. I don't have an answer for. Sometimes my head tells me some things, and I just follow. You know. But you're right. I don't know why I did that. Um. I think I want to surveil now. Yeah. No. No. But like. I should have played a Nethergoyf Bloodgust, and my blo my Nethergoyf would have been huge, I would have survived the fly. I, totally made sense, I, I don't know why I did that, I, I punted. I didn't even realize it, it was a mistake. <laughs> allora, facciamo un bel bomanzo. Viano, do you know what happened to Twitch? 
I didn't even realize it was you. You guys have no more badge. There's no more badge. What happened? Ooh, I can do a fancy play now. Let's focus. I can do a fancy play. I can like block first strike. Ah, no. Caputana, both have first strike. Ah. Vabbè, dai, comunque sì, I, 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 I do this and, and eat this, it's still very good. I don't... Dai, because I have Spy Master's Vault. Yeah. I'll just block, like, what, this? And connive. Mm-hmm. Do you want double block? Double block and connect on the first. If they have a removal spell, I still die though. It's the same. If they have a removal spell, I don't. They don't get to gain life. What? What? Why guys say double block? I don't understand. Oh, you're saying double block and pass priority. Ah, maybe double block pass priority. This is better. Double block pass priority. Yeah, this is better. No, no, no triple. No triple needed. I don't want my orc to die. Do you guys want your orc to die? Maybe. More things in the graveyard is better. So, first strike damage happens. And then normal damage happens. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, cappellato allora. Ma sono un coglione. I should have triple blocked. Mamma mia, I'm playing so bad. All right. Dai, wake up, Mango. Wake up. Ah, va bene. Va bene, va bene, va bene, dai. We're still in it. Knipe 3. Bloodgast. Might. Thoughtseize. I can die first, they kill a, a, a fizzle. I should just triple block, easy. Anyway. Facciamo. Uh, Nedergoyf from hand. Yeah, yeah, this card is very strong. And then Nedergoyf from graveyard. Okay, let's exile instant creature artifact sorcery. Done. I don't want to shock myself. F6. Yeah, man, if I didn't pun there, I would have had a token. This that would have killed that. I would have 4-4. Four, four. I would have actually attack this turn. No, I don't think I want to attack. They have flash in the graveyard. You you have static prison, okay. Uh-huh. On a 3-4. Was that Giganta? Okay, so you have Giganta and Mystery Card. Okay, you have Giganta in all lean and all lean and this game is over? I want to have your confidence. This game is not over at all. <laughs> they have Giganta and they have Flash in the graveyard. This game is very much away from over. If I draw white, then I am I'm, I'm in a good shape, but without it, I can't attack. I have to keep this Feather Profane for Flage. Draw. Uh, play Supplier before playing land, because I may draw more Blood Guests. Mm. Uh, I want to tap with a 5-6 Nettergoyf. Maybe. Maybe it's good to attack with a 5 6 Nether Go F. Because, like, you're probably playing Gigant and passing this turn. 
Oh, you want a flashback flash. Would you want to double block it? Okay. Maybe I shouldn't have played land, but I wanted to have... Yeah, maybe I shouldn't have played land. But I guess if you bring back Flash, now I want to kill it. So maybe that... I'll hold this in end for sure. Do I want to attack with more people now? Yeah, attack with Bloodgast and the Nether Goeth, and then I can... Knife. And yeah, this deck is definitely complicated, like, you have to play tight. Yeah, it gives them one life, but I want to um, uh, uh, do this ability. Uh, where, do I, where do I go? Maybe here, yeah. Okay. I'll discard Ghast. And I'll discard Takenuma. And I don't need to do anything. I'll pass now. Press down Shots Cast Trigger? No. No, cast, uh, cast trigger, go on the stack. No, you need to keep Feather Profane for Flash, don't throw your resources. Takenuma for White wasn't bad, but also Orc for Ocelot. But yeah, maybe Takenuma for White, Takenuma for White is like in next turn. No, I think it's too slow. You miss conniving with the bird. It's big same. Yeah, I made a tweet uh, the other day. I, Monday was like a odd set. It was like a sad day, Monday. I tweeted it. Going to bed, daydreaming about simpler times when we could play Ledger Shredder, Mishra's Bubble, connive and be happy about ourselves. Reap those days. Ripperoni. Allora, you play a Gianni. I think I wanna go Orc. Oh no, it's a lot. Oh, maybe not. Because now you can play Flash. And kill your own cat. Hmm. Maybe I should have just not done it. Although this matchup, I I played I played this matchup. I was playing Boris Energy. I won it with Ring very soundly. Like Ring was very hard for this deck to deal with. Opponent doesn't play Ring, so I think it's a. A matchup I can win. Plus, I made like several mistakes in this game. Several. I think if I played Titer, I could have won this game. You're playing Domain Zoo with three Ragavans, or are you a sinner? I mean, playing Domain Zoo, you can put anything you want in it. It's fine. Wow, the Fury, the Flage pitch me. Weird. I think you should have killed a cat and flipped a Johnny for sure. All right, I'll bring back two ghasts. Draw. Fabine. I think I want to go land because I want to connive here.
Why? Do I want to attack with ghasts? The point of flips a Johnny and I kill a Johnny and I leave Flash into play. What do you guys think? I leave I leave Flash into play. But I connive infinitely. Infinite. Yeah, I shouldn't have played Forest. Because I could have drawn into Fatal Push. Yeah, for now I'll pass. Maybe that wasn't the bad play. I think a Johnny may actually be better than Flash here. This game is lasting forever. I die on the spot to Goblin Bombardment. What's this? What's this, Obnixilus? That's Obnixilus. Yeah. Uh, I, I have to fall the profane, the, the Johnny, for sure. I'm just dead to it on the spot. No, it was a fight. The pushy. <laughs> You're orking. Yeah, it's over. It's over. It's over. GG. We got Toxic Deluge, we got Spell Bomb. What do we sign out? Here were Might. Maybe Thoughtseize. Sign out Thoughtseize, and then I bring in a couple of Endurance. Culling Ritual, yeah, I can add Culling Ritual. I guess it kills a lot of your stuff too. What's Surgical for if not Flage? I think Flage, but not from Boros. Because like, uh, Surgical's card is advantage. You accept that against um, just Guy, because you just switch off their deck. But if you do against an aggro deck, Um, plus, you have now other cards for that as well. Yeah, anytime I was playing Boros last weekend, people sided in Surgical against me, they never won. I mean, maybe they wouldn't have won anyway, but I think the fact that you lose two life and you discard a card against an aggro deck makes you even less likely to win. That's just the, the surgical extraction problem. It just puts you in such a disadvantage. If the opponent deck still functions. It's like the stone brain, same thing. I think needle is bad, you know. I get it have some planeswalkers, but I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's a one off. If you don't draw it, you're happy to have it in your deck. All right, I'm gonna get the survey land. Link to dust is better than surgical. I don't know. I think Neo's problem is the best. It's the card party and it does the thing. Alright, Toxic Dillo, we shall leave that on top. Uh, do we want to do something here? Yeah, yeah, I'll play Bowmaster if they play a creature. Gianluca, you seem like a very negative person. I want you to bring some positiveness on this chat. Negative people, they can go to Reddit, to Twitter, not in my comments though. They can go on those YouTubers, they always say negative things. Okay. 
First match against uh, Gruul cards. I think I'll do this. Q flip? I know I don't kill it, but almost. Eh. Bello, great draw, Gris. Bravo, Mangu. Gris minus Kilajani. And uh, attack. Reign of Glory? No, they can haste and kill a, ja a Grist now. Ma guarda te, la Madonna. No. <laughs> okay, sure, I'll take it. What'd you flip? Plage, va bene. Plage stays there. That's fine. I guess if I didn't have Grist, they wouldn't have played Raptor, because they could flip a 3 drop, so... It was good in the end. In them, let's play supplier. Nettergoyf, noise. Oh, no, so close. So close. I'll mysteriously shock myself and pass here. What's happening? No, I bet I must say it. Fleet is gone. All right, they mill blood gas and that go if I guess they have graveyard hate. Must be that must be the only reason to push the supplier. Ah, uh, so favor, bastardo. All right, so there's a world where I endurance myself. But the reality is that if you endurance yourself, not, you're not really accomplishing anything. I usually have cards in my deck. But you have cards in your deck regardless. It's not that you die of milling. So I think she should always endurance my opponents because of flash. Plus, I might, I might just eat this Amped Raptor now. Oh, wait, I eat the Amped Raptor because of Orc if they draw a card. A very bad sequencing. Very bad. Ah, oh, they can't draw now. I'm bad. But they this minus floated. You can't untap it on magical line. They flipped graver trespasser. Ma che cate sono? A caso proprio. You exile your own Ajani. Alright, and you finally attack. I was afraid you smelled the uh, endurance because I shot there, so. Draw. More graveyard hate. I think I'll play it so this thing doesn't flip and pass. Guide of Souls. Ajani, Ajan, Theo, bye bye. All of them. One more. Una mas. Una mas into play, please. Bye bye. They put two counters on Draveyard Trespasser. We have to hope the last card is in a burn spell. That's what we have to hope. Man, if they went on Raptor, the Endurance would have survived. Be pretty sick.
a chum block. Because I'm killing everything anyway, end of turn. Uh, see, then I can um, connive, so I can discard this Bloodgast. Okay, land, so they have no cards in hand. What you doing? Why you fetch now? Deck thickening? Time thickening? Yeah, I want F6. I know, I know. Alright. Uh, I can go uh, Toxic Deluge. X equal 5. And unfortunately, I cannot connive on anything. Oh, that's not true! Ooh. Wow! Check this out! Check this out! Wow! Boseju? Reanimate Ghast? Boseju is a swamp because of Urborg? Mamma mia! Que bota! Knive 77? I don't know, how much? Ha ha ha! Eva! Uh, I made a land already. I can keep one card. What card do I keep? Do I keep Saga? I think I keep Saga. Like the land that deals. I think. Bomb 7 6. Go. Man, that's brutal. <laughs> what did you draw? You you push. My bad. I kept Saga. Big brain. Always big brain. Never small brain. It was fun. Until it lasted. All us I'll can trip this bomb, I think. And niente, I got nothing. Go, Giganta is ready. But I got Saga. Saga is the one that definitely has the most value out of that hand. I'm not lucky to not draw more Bloodgast or, Nia or a Nether Shadow. Nether Boy. Oh wow, they can haste Giganta here. Man, I've done this play so many times. So many times. At the, at the tournament. Like, hasty Giganta. Reality Smasher. Reality Smasher. Eh, I can't do anything. I'll take it. Go to five. And I'll lose if they have a removal spell. Although, I've done everything I could have. If I lose, I lose. Charging Monstrosaur. Yeah, it is what it is. Yeah, they have removal spell, I lose. Okay, thank God. Thank God I don't lose to Giganta, dealing 10 damage. Okay. Man, I have not they haven't drawn anything. Very lucky. Knive. Uh I think I keep push.
The construct. We got Shadow Spear in our deck. And I think my opponent has nothing, so I'm just going for it now. I think I want to gain some very precious life here. Very precious life here. Going to 8, so I don't die to... Um, yeah. Maybe not, maybe I could have placed Teacher Supplier and chump with it. Maybe it would have been better. And I have to chump with a Construct, which is actually quite large. <laughs> Static Prison. Babine. I'll chump, I don't want to die to... Actually, they have no cards in end. Ah, Manji Shadow Spear. Makes sense. Oh, watch out, because my opponent may actually be dead here. Let me think about this. I can go Construct now, Construct later. What am I talking about? He did. Lord. Alright. Actually, this is the same play I did in my in my game. I, I static praise on the the Shadow Spear. I have no more targets for Saga. I didn't think about it, my opponent did sideboard in uh, the Pithic Needle. Oh, but I guess I had rings. Yeah. Dive point F6, please. Let me play fast. Let's go. Okay, my plan is to go Stitcher Supplier into either Bloodgast or Nether Goeth. Uh, well, they exalt two Goeth with uh, the Neil Spabble at the beginning. But I still have two more and I have uh, Bloodgasts. I think. Two blood guests. Yeah, the exiled one. I'll go supplier again. Echoly, Nether Goyf. Okay. Attack for four. Go. You think Nether Goyf is a good card to buy? Always buy. Regret later. There's always time to uh, to regrets about your purchases. But the happiness that giving the buy will never be topped. I guess I should also say that uh, this message is not given by an expert and my suggestions shouldn't be answered with uh, you should, should be ashamed of yourself for telling people to buy this. Disclaimer, I'm not a professional seller, buyer, financer. Neil 3. Hello, Want Wings. Do you enjoy more watching the old videos uh, than the MTGO streams? Just uh, uh, um, honest questions, not. Hello, I pump. Who do I pump? I think Bloodgast. Yeah. Oh, finally, Stuck Hath, the sort Flare of, of Malice. Uh, draw. I don't even know if that was actually a good draw, by the way. I maybe needed to push the Ajani instead. Oh, but, um... Attack with... All. No, all, maybe. Only Bloodgast. Professional buyer. That's true. I'm a professional, I'm a professional buyer. Uh, 
Uh, I think I want to attack with this and pass. Okay. Allora, um, they have, they have nothing. I'm just gonna reanimate the goifs and pass here. Keep a matza. I'm in a great uh, spot right now. Uh, instant land creature boo, uh, artifact. And then I go uh, enchantment land creature instant. All right, one well, minus six seven with flashback. Go. Professional money spender. Exactly. That's why I am. That's my name. Oh wow! I didn't think about that. That's true. Gigant uh, saga costs for two types with Nadergoy. Thank you. I didn't think about that. I don't know why I didn't think about that. Untap. All right, let's go flare for free. On Bloodgast. Land. Bloodgast back. Right click. Attack. With all but this. I'm making plays a totally random. I hope you can see it. Tell the profane. Classic. If I attacked it that too, I would have lethal, but it didn't. No, I guess they would have attacked. So. Yes! Victory! Victory, victory, victory! Champion! Oh wait, game two? No! I thought this was game three! Mama, This was so long! <laughs> Magic! Magic should learn from Lorcan and do best of two. Best of three is too much. I'm bored. I don't want to play anymore. Anyone wants to play the rest of my league? Anybody else wants to play the rest of my league? <laughs> so that I'm bored, is that I am properly satisfied? Put me in. You're in, Leaf Mode. I've had enough satisfaction, I don't want to play anymore. Best of two, you can draw, yes. Ilocana, if you draw, you get three points. If you win, you get seven points. I started it, I finish it. No! All right, Twitch, you're in charge. Tell me every play I need to make. No, actually, I don't have enough time. No, okay, so this was not this was not boring. Like, when you play against Storm, it's boring. When you play against Storm, you don't want to be in that chair. But when you play a match like this, it's it's fun, but it was it was very grindy. It was long, and, you know... As a person living in 2024, entertainment can be hard when it's this low. Do I recommend playing Lurkana right now? I've I've never played that. I just heard that thing about best of two and it's very smart. But does poor Kamadoska. But the smartest thing remains the ban list of flesh and blood, where they ban decks because they win. Not because what's he heard a Reddit set poster said that grief was unfun. Very jealous of other games for how they handle ban list. Actually, I don't know other games. I know I know that's how Flesh and Blood does. Honestly, Flesh and Blood gets me intrigued only because of their care for competitive magic. Wow, Static Prison just to get two energy. You think banning a deck because it wins is also wrong. My cat's a Dichi. That's like, how what do you want to ban? <laughs> that's obviously because it wins. That's the only reason why a deck should be banned. 
It doesn't bind every deck that wins. They bind a deck that wins too much. Uh, I think I blocked the cat. Uh, got some mana. Oh! There you go. Let's go Mortuary. Trigger. Perfect. Perfect. Um... I pass. Static Prison dies. What do you think about Prowess? I think it's fine, it's not very good, but you can definitely win a tournament with it. Okay, I don't want to go Flare, maybe I should have. Maybe I should have. Gigantine end. No. Oh, special chico, 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 chico. No! Because I have six. That would have flared in response. Par caput. Banana. Is that. I gotta play fast at four minutes. Da you, da you. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. I just need to win on time. Sorry, on time. Uh, before my opponent. Uh... Oh, you can actually give it two counters now. But you don't. Thank God. Alright, don't ask me too many why don't you right now. I have four minutes on the clock. I'm obviously playing bad. Like, you know what I mean? Obviously, I'm playing bad. I already play bad when I have 25 minutes. Imagine when I have four. Allora. Talk with all. You go Giganta Hasty now. You would love to give it flying, but we play Flare Response on the God of Souls. Ah, yeah. Flare. Suck Gast. F6. 3 minutes 56. I can do this. Land. My man wants to figure out though. Dude, poor opponents. They drew so many lands both game 2 and 3. Oh, what you do now with your Gantha? With your Giant Mare? What you do now? Elemental Elk. You leave the card on top, huh? Mysterious. A mysterious opponent, I see. Why wow, you passed? Allora, instant creature. Arkaeb, I don't have types, right? I don't have it. I don't have four types. E niente, I gotta pass. Maybe I'll attack with this. Yeah, I'll attack with the Stitcher Supplier, actually. Oh, wow. He blocked? Weird. Okay, I'm now able to bring it back. Sorcery, land, creature, instant. Play land, pass. Yes. Zero. So he left the card on top. 
with the scry. What is it? Oh, Caputanet's Flage. Va bene, it's actually not too bad. I think the game will actually be decided on time. I don't see myself winning. Normally. Three minutes. Mamma mia! Che culo! Okay, there's three cards in the graveyard. So I'm not gonna attack with all. Right? They can go Arena of Glory, they can go Surveil Land, Flage, 3 damage here, attack 3 damage there, I'm not dead. So I should attack like this. This way I don't die to Fetch Land. Because I can go Fetch Land, Surveil Land. They drew Fetch Land. So they can't go Arena of Glory hasty. Sorry, they go Flage hasty. They concede? <gasps> you know what? They don't have a third survey land. They don't have a third survey land. They only play two. Mamma mia, what a game. They've drawn very poorly, game two and three. But I'm glad we won. Alright. Take a bathroom break, and uh, yeah, I'll play again. Alright, new match. Hand is solidissima. Dab no. gem, Necro surgical is bad. Only side surgical against Jessica Control and Gorio. Okay, let's go. We got White of the Reliquary. Ooh, Mysticalous Archive. All of Fetch, Fetch, Fetch. Fetch, Fetch, Fetch. Fetch, Survey, Land. Creature in the Graveyard. Can I get a Blood Guest? I think it's still a Graveyard. I play white. It probably dies. Ripperoni. My hand is too bad against blue white, so. I mean, this means I just guy, so. I have like. Very, very few chances. Oh wow, Muslim Wanderer. Nice. Nice! Alright, Magical Line heard me, said I didn't want to stitch a supplier, so they gave me two back to back. Thank you, Magical Line. Thank you for shuffling for me. Always a pleasure. I think I'm actually sacrificing the supplier now. In combat phase. Just to do more damage. Uh, what land do I get? I don't want to get Saga because I need black sources. Let me just get a uh, random land like, well, like Five Masters Gold. Yeah. They should be in Urborg. No, sh for sure I should have gotten your Borg. I punted. I punted. Yeah, for sure should have been your Borg. Spectra Sailor. Anadja. The moment I took this, I thought about Urborg. Bobby, it's okay. What's this? Droxical Captain? Is it? Is it it? Oh, Skycleave. Okay. A. Yep. 
If I push, I'm gonna kill this and get a 2 2 if I Durborg. Let me orc immediately. I'm gonna flare up denial, I guess. Okay. I think I want to go. So it's up, right? Because I flip it on top, I have to go supplier. I think I'll go bottom here. And then I'll push the sailor. Oh, John Samu. Yeah, it's been going well so far. I definitely make mistakes here and there, but overall, uh, this deck is actually definitely challenging to play. A lot of survey land that you have over there. I'll play Grist, take up, and pass. I can't flare sacrificing the token. Or is this saga would have been good? Rattle chain. Chump. Katonia Nag there may work in this deck. It may. It may work in this deck. Yeah. No. I lost. The flare of body says non token. Yeah, I should have fetched Swamp, I guess. No, Urborg. I think if I fetch Urborg, the game is very different. I'm actually very favorable to win, but I didn't. My fault. I don't think we have much. I'll just submit. Maybe maybe endurance I can have. Over one more saga. New spell bomb village rights, something like that. Let's go. Okay. Log guest. It's more ideal to discard it off of the Spy Master's Vault and reanimate. But I think having Grist in end makes me want to just play it. I skip the land drop. If they subtlety, they don't subtlety. They kept a wall and they're on the draw without subtlety. Questionable choice.
wrist supplier attack for three do I want to play Bazeju as a land do I want to hold Bazeju for Vile that's unlikely I'll, uh, I'll play it and pass We have to be thinking about uh, the Arbinger of the Seas, but I guess we have Grist now, so... We don't die to it anymore. And my board is mono 1-1s. One -ones. So many 1-1s. One -ones. You gonna have a rattle chain? There's no creature in the gray here for Grist Emblem. Uh, minus two. Sacrifice Orc Army. Kill Supreme Phantom. Takudo. Whatever they block, I'll connive on. They don't block anything. Okay, I'll still connive. On uh, this, I guess. Um, yeah, Scrutis 2. I'll play Nettergoyf. And pass. Well, minus six, seven. You go subtle to pitch Arbinger. Um, so I will also want to do this, I think. Yeah. Yeah, I'll do this. I'll put it on top. Well, minus six seven that returns from the graveyard. But this deck is very good at uh, making it big. You have like basically all the types of the game. You're missing only Kindred, formerly known as Tribal. And Bottle, that's true. There's also the Bottle. Yeah, it's true. You can only need you only need to exile two cards, Saga and Wrist. All right, game three. Nameless inversion. Do I want Pithing Needle for Saga? I like every other card. It's going. It's a very tiny Saga package of two Saga, one Shadow Spear. Of course, Drew the two Sagas. <laughs> Alright, keep. Put a multi six. And consider it a kept a Wallander vial with a land being tapped. That seven card must have been very bad. I think I go to 15 on turn 1 here. And yeah, not having uh, Pithy Neal in my deck will definitely be hurting me now. 
Ooh, that's true. Golgari Bounce Land. Yeah, maybe Golgari Bounce Land is good. You can you can take it and bounce back Bajuka Bog. Hey, or unfortunately, I have to like. Hmm. I think I have to like shock myself down to 12. I dealt myself 8 damage in the first two turns of the game. On Saga was searching the stock. True, true, you can do that as well. Yeah, this deck, this deck, uh, this deck looks definitely a fun deck. And again, it top aided uh, 79 people are sick you. It lost to me in the Swiss and to the just kind of drifter that I played earlier in the top eight. Oh, they leave the card on top. Must be a spirit. Hey, hey, I'm, I'm, I'm going all in now. And I guess they have this. All in of what? All in is cat, so they just counter my Toxic Deluge. I wish it up. Hello. Hello. I think I'll play Stitches Supplier. Love Gust. Uh, I guess I should have attacked first. Like dead next turn. I mean, there's a world where I win on turn five. Next turn, I have five mana. And I go Toxic Deluge and you don't have any spirit to pump this. It's my plan, I guess. I'll attack with white. Um, do I want to... No, I don't care about pumping it now. I said my land of losing too much life. I mean, what do you want to do? What do you want to do? You don't want to curve out Tosses into white? Maybe not. Maybe we should just curve out top land into top land Thoughtsies. Maybe more be more reasonable. Hmm. I'll sacrifice liar and get pyrection tower as well to pay I think it's fine, right? No, but like, if they have a spirit, I need to pay four. And I don't have four anyway. So next turn, I think I just have to go Toxic Deluge for one. Now let's think about it. This is important now. The game decides here. If they have a... I can go five mana, Toxic Deluge. I think I have to do it for one. If I do it for two, I die to like route chain. 
The thing is that if they do it for, I guess if they, if they do it for two, they just pump these anyway, and they and they counter my Toxic Deluge, and then I die regardless. Yeah, I'll go get more Chori just to. Nah, nah, I decided to go Tower. On top. I can't play around with anything, I think. Unfortunately. Right, so I will talk with both. Then I'll sacrifice the ghast. Do I want to? Is it free to go suck two mana? No. Yeah, the life loss definitely lost me the game. Yeah, no, I should have gotten um should have gotten more tree last turn. Doesn't matter too much because I'm gonna pay five anyway now, but Yeah, so we have to hope they don't have a spirit in end. I cannot beat a spirit. I unfortunately, I'm not able to beat a spirit. I would have been able to beat a spirit if I had like a crumbling vestige in my deck. I think I have to do one. Let's see. Spell Queller. Point of Tower. I have this thing, I can exhaust my ghast. I don't think it matters. Wow, Surveil. That's good hope. Nah, I died to Shackle Geist. My God, that thing. I died to Shackle Geist. It's exactly. No, it's not exactly lethal, but. Wait a sec. Oh, no, no, never mind. Never mind. Yeah, if I do X equal to, I still die. Yeah, I got no outs. Ah, I think I punted this match. I think I had this match. I guess I just take it slow and don't... And don't take 8 damage to begin. Alright, new match immediately. Let's go. I mean, if I do the Luge for two, I'm dead on board anyway. It's just end of turn Shackle Geist. No, I think I can't beat any two drops they have in end. In that spot, obviously I could have played it much different. I mean, I was on the play, I wasn't on the draw. I would be on the draw if I curve out top lands, that's for sure. Oh no, that's not true. Yeah, yeah, I was on the play, yeah. I could be a Rattle Chain. I mean, I was beating Rattle Chain. No, also, that's not true. They just play it and tox me for four, so they just attack in the air for four.
They just ride us. Which is quite good against my hand, since I was hoping to play against some one ones with my Orcish Bowmaster. Yesterday's video I posted was about Rhinos. I lost every match. Indra Swamps? No, eh? So I might. Uh, yeah. Fortunately. His mind is very weak. I guess I'll make some constructs. That's gonna be the way, I hope, to get there. I could also just village right a orc army. Since this is pretty useless, because I can't sacrifice it to the flare. It made little sense they said non-token. I don't know. Alright, they're about to cascade. They are about to cascade. Yeah, Bino, again, I posted that video uh, yesterday. You play. Leyline and Mamma Mia. The clankiness. Um, I was able to draw the only artifact in my deck. Oh, yes, there's two artifacts in my deck. All right, let me go with village rights on the orc army. Raw land, then I can make a saga construct. Not pass. It seems like a totally different deck than before. <laughs> four four trample. With flare of malice and pass. Then the constructs can become very large. I spent six mana to make creatures, they spent three. Let's see if they have more common. <sighs> I'll concede. All these artifacts are bad. <laughs> They're all bad. I guess now you are mighty good because they play Lila and Cyan.
I bring one surgical so that you guys can rejoice. I didn't have any artifacts in my deck to search. The surgical curse. So having push is pretty bad. What deck do I suggest to someone who wants to play modern for the first time? As always, the first question to ask is the budget. Because I would say <laughs> porous energy with rings if you have a spare. $2,000. Uh, I think I'm gonna go land and let it go. Yeah, I can cast it from hand. They was just going to make two more tokens and. I wasn't having I was not having a good time, so I conceded. Any thoughtsies? Broderhood's hand. Yeah, the uh the badges are gone. Sorry, Twitch is kinda like doesn't have bad I don't know, it's weird, because I guess some people have them. I don't know why some people have the badges and people don't. Ooh, that's good. It's a good card, isn't it? Can can it survive Brotherhood? It can't. It's been very good. Black Mister, thank you, thank you. That's a saga very strong. Let's go. Sydney's explanation. What is it, Viano? Thank you guys. Spots and Fleck. Welcome. Uh, well, played as might. I think so, right? Because they have binding here and they're about to cast it. Guy, do you throw this rough demos modder? You refuse to play any of the top four decks. Well, consider that uh, the one ring will be banned. But the the thing is that Watsi is not very good with banning, so it might take a long time. If you want to win, you have to buy the ring. If you are okay with losing to the one ring and don't want to buy it, I think the best decks without the one ring are Mardu Energy, which is also quite expensive, and uh, maybe the Jeskai Noel Drifter that I played earlier is actually not that bad. You also have the. Storm, but that's pretty miserable. I wouldn't recommend it to anyone. But they murk that decks, but at the moment they're not very good. Maybe they can become better if things change. Zoo Rhinos are updated. I mean, I'm losing to Rhinos now, but. Played a league with it, it was not it was not good. And Zoo, I think, is just a worse aggro deck than Boros is. Which is fine. Again, you can do that if you're on a budget, but and to focus on competitive um aspect. Why should a Mardu play one ring too? Because I think you actually lose a lot of life in Mardu. And also it's not that you have infinite slots, like why do you have why why are you splashing black for? Like can't you just be Boros? Like, I I don't have anything to cut from Boros to put an orc already. I'll get a swamp and I'll make a token. 
The problem is that the opponent has Brotherhood. I'm just gonna kill all my artifact next turn. Maybe I don't. Oh yeah, I don't. I don't have mana anyway. Well, creativity coffers Gorio. Well, earlier I streamed. I think I'm taking uh, Iwarmite because it's the worst among the two. Earlier I streamed Gorio post ban. It's fine. I'm not gonna say that it's the best deck, but it's still a fine deck. Oh, I'm lethal here, by the way. What do you have? Wow, you just died. I did so little, and you died. Take it, man. I don't want to register surgical. That's okay. One surgical and a dream. This end uh, is not good on Mulligan. This hand is slightly better. I just played a crushing footfalls every game, that's funny. Top lane go. They go sign or Draco is very good, but we have the answer for it. Hope I don't draw surgical. Eh, I think despite everything, this crushing footfalls over here would be my death. If I had a nether go if maybe, I don't know if I guess can grow. No, shock on tapped. What have you drawn? Attenzione, Urborg, it unlocks all my base issues. I can go double Goef. Watch Nether Goef hold Rhino's army. I'm ready for it. What I wish did I find. Why did you shock here? The Violent Thought Burst? Doesn't work. <laughs> why, did, why did I shock? All right, Rhinos are coming. No, you took the shardless, Madonna mia. I need to draw something that fuels my goif. Come on, Stitcher Supplier. That monster is small. Land go. Player not good here. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> that is indeed not good here. Mitchell, I don't think they did because I lost every match. 
So if they did watch it, they wouldn't have played Rhinos. So you can see actually they did not watch it. Oh, block. Alright, it's a 3 4. And it also has Spam Master's Vault. I connived twice, twice. Do you say twice, twice, or you say twice, two times in English? Anyway, um, this is, this is, this is that all four cards are bad, so what do I do? You can have two twice, okay. All, all these cards are bad anyway, what should I do? I guess not spend too much time on it. Bam, six, seven, go if. Macquanke Page. Alright, Pashuka Bong, a Verdant. I guess if I discard Saga, it's good to bring back Nether Goyf and still have a large um, large Goyf, right? Yeah, maybe I'll discard Saga here. 8 9. Big. Big boy. On top. A boss as the player. Alright, so I can go Nether Goyf. Uh, uno, due, tre. And then I exile Land Enchantment Artifact Creature. That's it. I think I can only exile two cards. And it's a 3 4. Do I want to play land? Yes, so I can um, connive again. The point is I have two more rhinos. I feel like I can beat these rhinos. The problem is that they will eventually draw their spells. I keep on having this village right in my hand. I really don't want to have. I don't know. I, I could knife four and still I have the same hand as last turn. And it was bad hands. <laughs> really did not help the connive. Sign of Draco. Not bad. Actually, I'm glad I still have Flare of Malice then. Hey, you attack me? Or not? You don't attack me. Va bene. Let's go Flare of Malice. Sacrifice Nedergoyf. And then connive to Perfect. Thoughts is a But yeah, I think I like village rides with blood gas now if I top the like land. I guess I have a land here, I burn a catacomb. Okay, another one in end. Uh oh look, I've a chamonet go if I show up. Exile. Sorcery instant land. I know cats, so I have to exile a uh, blood guest. Hmm. Alright, let's do this then, cancel. Fetch. Get land. Return blood guest. Sacrifice it. 
with this village right that I've been holding in my hand forever. Finally, cash it in for two cards. I believe in you, village rights, from the day you were born. From the first... Oh, man. Village rights, you did your job. Thank you. Thank you for your service. Uh, now. I got Nether Goeth. And bye-bye, Bloodgast. I also thank you for your service. And then I guess I'll play land for the surveil. Maybe not. No. Go. You have no cards in hand. The surveil here would just be milling, which isn't good. You drew land like binding without it. Any regret I had this game was to was to surveil uh sorry to exile differently with the with the first Nettergoyf. Could have exiled different cards like sorcery yeah sorcery instant or is a saga. I think it would have been better. All right. Would have not met. I don't know. Maybe would have. Anyway, I definitely played properly the first two matches and much worse the round three and four. But I hope you had fun watching. This was a long league. This deck is definitely requires a lot of uh, thoughts. So you can't just click buttons when you play this deck. Um, maybe you can, you know, pick this up. Change something. You can put Catonia Nightmare in the mix, maybe. But the White Red Aquarius definitely felt good. Watch this video on YouTube, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you next time.